All right, guys, back on the Randonautica trail, back again, back to win, uh, using Randonautica, using my app, Scaranoia app. We got an entourage following behind us here. Uh, we are heading to the first pinpoint of the day. The app spit out this location immediately as soon as we stated the intent. Uh, things that mean death. I didn't even signal that I was turning right there, so that could have meant death for us. Um, no, they're not. They must have went the other way. I don't know. I just all of a sudden looked back and there was a lot of people behind us. Dude, I'm ready to turn the hell up today. I'm excited. Are you? I am. I wanna, I wanna find some scary, scary. Okay, uh, turn right, go 200 feet. That would take us like right back to that fence line, right? Just about. No. Okay, uh, let's stay right here. You think I could? You think I can just stay right here on the street? Okay. All right. Well, yeah, it does look pretty dead, doesn't it? Oh, you know what's down there? <laughs> I don't know why I got so excited. There's that area where I fell and shit that one time. That's funny. Um, yeah, there's the the shitty area That's down there. Okay, just in case. All right, sounds good. Uh, things that mean death, and this was suggested by my main man, JC, my son, Jace, Jace with the face. All up in your face. All up in this place. All right, I guess we need to go. St Ooh, this looks a little swampish. Ew. It looks a little swampy. Ah, oh, it looks a little soupish. I uh, just got done raining uh, about an hour or two ago. It was actually supposed to rain all day, so I guess we're pretty lucky. We'll head straight to the pinpoint first, see if we find anything, and. Then we'll look around. We got a lot of area. Oh, uh, is that a church? Yeah, I guess that's a church. Looks churchy. <sighs> Pretty day. Look at that beautiful little area right there. Huh. That makes you want to suck a pickle, huh? I, I don't know why I said that. Who the fuck thinks like that? Jesus, Jody. What the hell is that? Is that a piece of a shotgun shell, bro? Piece of a freaking shotgun shell. Wow. On a church parking lot. A church, church, church parking lot? Park, parky type, you know, type area, whatever you want to call this right here. I'm still not sure if that's a church, but really nice area to find something like that. Okay. Let's see. Oh, yep, there's a big cross right there. So I think we did end up on what you would call, I guess, church grounds. How you doing? Just geocaching. That's it. Gave me a location. It's right here, pinpoint. That's what I do for a living. I'm on YouTube. Huge channel. Yeah, yeah. No trouble. Gentleman was just checking on me to make sure I wasn't causing any trouble over here. What is that? Is that a tomato? I think it is. Yeah. You know what? It's actually a good looking tomato too. I tell people, you know, geocaching, because a lot of people don't know what Randonautica is, and it is basically the same thing. It's, you know, just like a, I guess the only difference really is the way that the apps find the locations and things like that. So, um, you know, like my app, Scaranoia app, the way that it finds locations is it has a database that the tech people behind the app have compiled of uh, places where, you know, it's more about finding scary, scary. So like places where crimes have happened, places that are considered to be haunted, and they take all that data and they put it in the app. So if you get in the vicinity of anywhere that something like that has happened, um, it, it will give you... It'll give you that location, you'll end up there, and it'll be up to you to find the core of what you're asking to find. It's a little weird. I thought he was gonna probably tell me, hey, I'm the pastor of this church, you gotta get the heck out of here. Um, which would not be a very churchy thing, but he seemed okay. He just probably wanted to make sure, like, hey, you know, you're not doing anything. What's that right there? Oh my God, I think we found something right away, bro right away 
and it's got owls all over it. Oh my God. What? Dude, what is that? How crazy is that? That is wild. It's filthy nasty too. It looks like it's been here forever. Look at that. I don't really want to take this, but I, I love to show her my finds. And anyway, the way the Randonautica works is, is very different from my app. And uh, I don't quite understand it, but supposedly it, it works on a lot of different kind of physics. So there's that. Nice little area though. Oops. I should have wore some some uglier shoes, but it is what it is. We're out here. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna give up. Things that mean death. I, I don't think this means death. I think this is just coincidence. This has been out here for a hot minute. That's why I'm still looking, by the way. Usually I find something, I give up, I go on. But that right there is something. I doubt we'd find anything here though. Cause this is like, you know, I don't know, sacred ground, holy ground, whatever you would want to call it. You probably seen my truck and realize like, hey, this guy is definitely probably about that scary, scary since he's got a whole truck dedicated to it. And I also don't like to say I'm a YouTuber with a huge channel, but everybody tells me it's a huge channel. A uh, quarter million followers, almost, what, almost 40 million views. Actually, I got 40 million views, but several million of those views are on private for a reason I can't speak about. But, you know, I still got like 30, almost 37 million that are public. So I guess it is a pretty big channel. But uh, I'm just a humble guy, man. I, I'm, you know, a little bit modest, that's all. But in these situations, I will go ahead and I'll pull out the card and say, hey, look, you know, <laughs> there might be 10,000 people seeing this video now. <laughs> oh, there's something right there in the woods. What is that? Bro, tell me that's something cool. And it's not, it's a box. Ah, it's a box. <sighs> hmm. Man, I'd really like to go back in there. I'll have to come back here during the winter and maybe this will be more accessible. Is that a cup? Yep, a little cup. Wonder who is back here. Oh my God, get off me. Jesus. It's back here tipping on the old coffee, huh? What is that? What is that? Bro, what? Dude, look how it's sitting too. What? Two things at one location? Oh my god, things are eating me up, bro. 
That's been here for a while too. Oh my God, look at that. What are the chances we find something with owls on it and something with the skull or day of the dead type deal? Little butterfly skull. <sighs> all right, all right, all right. We, we found some stuff. Let's get to the let's get to the truck and review. I ain't putting this in my truck, man. This stuff is filthy nasty. I love when this happens though. It, it, it hasn't been happening a lot to where we end up at a location and we find things quick. It's been a lot of, uh, what's that? We end up at a location, spend 20 or 30 minutes and maybe we find one thing, maybe we find nothing at all. That's been our, our, our life for a while now. Hey, hey young lady. Oh, she, yeah, that's right, she's in the driver's side. All right. Okay, walk around that way when I'm filming. I got you. Hi, All right. I'm so anyway, I found these two things Ooh. over here, and they are filthy nasty. That's why I wasn't even going to try and bring them in. Is that what smells? That's what. It just smells out here in general. Uh, but, yeah, look at that. Things that what mean death. That? I mean, that's like a Day of the Dead type art, right? Maybe? Yeah, you would... Like, and then the randonautica well you know it's not randonautica but it's owls we always find a lot of owls so i haven't checked to even see if there's anything in that throw it down and i'll open it but it is nasty did you see the guy come out yeah out of nowhere well i guess his house is back there he probably just was making sure i wasn't like there's nothing in it nothing okay just rainwater. let's uh let's put it in the back of the truck so we can throw it away somewhere because I don't want to put it back down because then it might look like I'm littering here. Littering okay? and? Yes, littering and. All right. Yeah, so that is a church right there. All right. First one of the day and we find two things. Uh, just getting started here though, guys. So that was a nice little warm up, but uh, Anyway, yeah, he's, he, at first I was thinking he was going to say, get the hell out of here, which wouldn't be very Christianly. Uh, <laughs> but he, he was okay. He, I, he probably just wanted to make sure, hey, this guy looks a little thuggy. Want to make sure, you know, he's, uh, you know, not moving like a boss. Are those porta potties knocked over? Where? Right there. Ew. I don't think that they were ever in use. Yeah. I think they're probably getting ready to put those up. But anyways, guys, we'll come back online here in a minute. All right, guys, we are heading to the next one right now. Uh, we, we're only like maybe 15 minutes away from the last location, so it didn't send us too far out the way. Something that will stun you, or better yet, hopefully it will be something that stuns me. I don't know if there's anything that stuns me anymore. You know what stuns me? Me. You. I stun me. I stun me all the time. And I stun a lot of people too. Do I stun you? Yeah. I'll stun day. gun you. I was just going to say somebody's going to stun gun you. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, oh, shit. Hold on. Wait a minute. Uh, turn that phone up. Okay. Sunday. It looked like it was left. Okay. Uh, looks like it's just right here to the right. I don't see anything there, do you? Dry it up. This looks like it's all wide open. I don't know how there's going to be anything here that's going to stun me. It's gonna stun me that there ain't shit here for once. How about that? Does that say biohazard? Yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. That's stunning. I would have never called that. There is a biohazard dome right here in the middle of this parking lot. Alright. I guess you're gonna watch me walk around and try and stun myself. Don't sting yourself. <laughs> I don't know about stunning, but bitch, you stunning. I might pull up. And give you a pumpkin on your bumpkin. Call me Daddy Lumpkin. She'll be like, oh my God, Jody, I'm going to give you something. I'm like, hell yeah, girl, it's all or nothing. You my chicken and I'm your dumpling. She's like, fuck that, Jody. Take my starkey and give me some stuffing. She got that starkey. Let's see. Pinpointage is right here, so. um, uh, A little rocky, a little swampy. Makes you feel like eating some Takis in the bathtub, doesn't it? Only if you're naked. Calm down. 
Hmm. It's just a little rocky. Hmm. Oh, look at there. There's some woods. What would you know? Of course there is. There's always some woods. Everywhere we go, we always see the woods. Let's go look around this biohazardy shed thing over here. <sighs> Technically, if, if, pinpoint right here, 500 feet steps over there, steps in those woods, steps over there towards the highway. A lot of ground to cover, my lover. Hmm. Let's see. ditch witch action hear the cops off in the distance I think they got them one oh yeah all right let's look up here by this building and see if we see anything Right now, it looks like I'm looking for a needle in a haystack because it's just so wide open. I can, and it's nice and cut, so you can just see everything. Come on, that look down here. A Budweiser bottle or a bush bottle. My bad. I'm sorry. It's not the bud. It's the bush. It's the bush in the bud. The Alma the Fud. The white known of the Judd. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see if we can find something out here, ladies and gentlemen. We're gonna try and find something purdy. Highly doubt that. <laughs> it ain't gonna be purdy, but we're gonna find something. Hmm. Sounds like those cops, it's taking them forever to get wherever they're going. But it sounds like it's getting closer and closer. Ah, oh, here's something we see a lot. This random wire sticking out. That shit looks like it's, uh, is it, no, it's not attached, but still, like, scary. Oh, they're coming around the corner, going 155 miles per hour. Oh, they're speeding ahead, ladies and gentlemen. Guys, if you haven't already, smash that thumbs up, comment below, share this on social media. But also, make sure you're subscribed with notifications turned on on my other channel, The Scream Scene. Oh, there they go. Yeah, it only took you guys about freaking 10 fucking minutes to get up there. Somebody's going to die if they're going to drive that slow. <sighs> Anyways, on my channel, The Scream Scene, uh, I do anything that has to do with horror filmmaking. Uh, anything that has to do with that scary, scary. I do reviews, reactions, interviews, uh, chats about things, you know, my, my opinion and my feelings on things that are coming out movie-wise and games. Just, just anything that has to do with the horror vein. But uh, I just interviewed some people that you guys might be familiar with. I did an interview with my buddy Omar Gosh over there. Uh, I got an interview with CJ Faison. Uh, I might be posting that soon. But I got a lot of interviews and things coming up. So make sure you're subscribed. Again, with notifications on. Because if you don't have those notifications on, you'll just never know the video exists. What happened here? Hmm. Something that stuns me, just a red circle in the middle of the road and, and almost a whole red circle. I don't know if it stuns me, it's just, it's weird. I 
I better find a hell of a lot more than than this. Today's starting off a little bit weak, but I mean, I mean that's okay. You can't win all the time, bro. It wouldn't even be fun if we won all the time. If if, if every single time we went out rando nodding within five or ten minutes, we would find something. It just would defeat the whole purpose of an adventure. Uh, I would be cool. You could get more adventures in. But I really like it whenever I have to work for my dinner. You know what I'm saying? When I have to work for my surprise. The fuck was that? I like to work for it, baby. You know what I'm talking about? Daddy likes to put some work in. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I like to put some work in. I like it when she gets to twerk in. This is for certain. She keep that thing perking while I'm working and she twerking. I'm certain, I'm serving. Got her on my head like a turban. She flirting. About to step up in the woods. About to step up in some good. Yo, know, she's like, oh my God, Jody, would you step up in my hood? Sure, girl. What's up? How you doing? Oh my, never knew it. Would you do it? Would you blow it? Did it blew it? Baby, you the truest. I don't know what to do with you and your tattoos. Got me in a mood. Don't mean to be rude. About to sing Hey Jude. Hmm. I don't know. This is looking a little soupy in here. There might be something here. <clears throat> I'm always a little, you know, sketched about stepping into the woods. I don't even care if they are somewhat, you know, gutted like this. <gasps> Whoa, the fuck was that? Dude, something just grabbed my arm. Bro, something just grabbed my fucking arm. I'm not even kidding. Bro, that just freaked me out. For real, that just freaked me out. Something just grabbed my arm. Was the intention again? Something that stuns you? Something just, uh, that just stunned me. I don't have a mark or anything. But that was weird. Bro. I don't know. I almost want to pull the spirit talker out. Is that stupid though? I feel like a hand just grabbed me. I'm not kidding. Like it wasn't a mosquito bro. Like it felt like something just grabbed my arm. I swear. Wouldn't that be some sh Oh my God. Something just touched my leg. All right, bro. I'm pulling out the spirit talker. Hold on. Hold on a second. What the hell? What the hell? Um... Dogs are going crazy somewhere. See if this thing is even gonna work. Okay. Uh, did something just try and grab me? Did someone just try and grab me right here? Could you please come forward and speak if so? Tell me if it was you. Hello? Battle. Battle. What if I'm standing on a freaking old battleground right here, bro? I used to have this friend that would know. They knew this area really, really well, but I'll just have to rely on Google. I'll have to, to look it up. Um, I might very well... Dude, I might very well be standing on a battleground. I do think I've heard... You know what? There is a... I think it's a military base that's like just a few miles up the road from here. Are there soldiers here? Is that what just touched me? Something just happened. Somebody just grabbed my arm. Can you tell me what happened there, please? 
I'm not trying to cause you any trouble or anything. I'll explain what I'm doing here if you want me to, just tell me. How was that? Little green sack. Little green sack. About to get them green backs. You ain't never seen that. I could not drop a video for two days and they'll be like, oh my God, Jody Dean's back. <gasps> oh. Thank you so much. Uh. I'm not sure what I did, but you're welcome. What's that right there? There's a piece of concrete. A grave marker, maybe. Go figure that something would happen in the woods. Why does something always happen in the woods, bro? Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Is anybody there? What happened with the battle? Excuse me. Are you are you done talking? Was that it? Battle, thank you so much. I just want to know who touched me or, or, or did something touch me. Can you just confirm, please? I mean, you ain't got to confirm. I know something touched me. There's a tire. That means we're going to find something. That means we're going to find something right now. Not right now, but that means something's here. Something significant. I mean, technically, I did get stunned, but I'd rather find something that stuns me. There is nothing coming through this spirit talker, bro. Busy. How are you? Are, are, am I? Who's busy? <laughs> I'm busy trying to figure out what's going on here. Come on now. Coming to Yeehaw. Drop me a line. Drop me two of them. Are you standing here where I can't see? Please don't let me, Mr. Spirit, walk into a swarm of bees. If you're trying to get my attention, yes, you had me. I mean, how couldn't you? I felt my fucking arm when you grabbed me. It was like, you know, like somebody's trying to get your attention and like somebody grabs your arm. Like that's what it was like. Like it was a nice tug, bro. There was nothing that my arm got cut on, cut, caught on or nothing. And still no mark. <sighs> Sometimes the marks show up a minute later, but Nicola. Dude, I got questions. Uh... Battle, thank you so much, Busy Nicola. I like Coca Cola. <laughs> um, I don't know. I, I, I'm getting some responses, but hopefully, maybe we caught like a EVP or, or something. Um, you know, whenever. Uh, oh shit! What's mortuary? What the hell? Mortary? I don't even know what that means. Hello? Oh, interesting. Tell you what I'll do. Uh, I got the volume up. I'll leave it going in my pocket. We'll check it in a second. Uh... There's something right there. What is that? Is that a bucket? Shit. 
My mom's constantly getting on to me. Jody, I watched your video and you're just stepping into anything. You don't care. Are you trying to get hurt? Are you trying to die? Are you trying to give me a fucking heart attack? I just had snot come out of my nose. Yes, mom, that's exactly what I'm trying to do. No, 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 no. I just like that scary, scary. I'm addicted and I go into where no other man goes. <laughs> How about that? Oh. Well, that's just fucking great, Jody. No, Mama Mama D is really cool, man. She's really cool. But she does tell me I, I, I constantly almost give her a heart attack watching these videos. And it's like crazy because you want your mom to watch your videos, but you don't want her to have a heart attack. So it's like, what do you do? <laughs> what do you do? I thought maybe there's gonna be something in this ditch. There's nothing. There's another can of bush over there. There's bushes everywhere. You guys know what I'm gonna say right now, don't you? I need a burrito. I need a burrito, a fucking Cheeto, a Dorito, a Enchirito. Nah, bitch, what you talking? I ain't on that keto. I might pull up and stretch out my pee hole. I'm like, oh my god, ooh, that's disgusting. Why are you cussing? I'm like, shut the fuck up, bitch. Don't say nothing. <laughs> what do you think of that? I might hit that shit from the back with the bat. Oh my god, Jody, how could you? Would you? Should I? Should you? Yes, I should. Here's some fucking wood. Hey, there's something right there. There is something right there. <laughs> okay, all right, I just got excited. Oh, I'm mid hard right now, mid hard, mid hard. Okay, okay, there's something leaning. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is going on here? Hey, now little mama, come on. Oh. Ew. Ewie. What the fuck? What the hell is that? What the fuck? What the shit? There's a button. What's it say? Switch push on. Hold on, Alicia. Alicia's yelling. I'm not yelling, but she's trying to. What'd you say? Your phone just said forest. My phone just said forest? What is it? Is it connected to the truck? Yeah. <gasps> it did. Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh my god! Forest, Carl, planning, mortuary, Nicola, busy. Thank you so much, battle. Holy fucking chicken nuggets. All right, I just found something stunning. Liquor dispenser. What the hell? Who wants to drink their liquor like that? Are you telling me? Are you telling me that the liquor comes out of there? <gasps> what? What? Dude, he's holding on to his Johnson stick. His fucking old Johnson rock, the baloney pony. What? Bro, I'm about to show you some shit that's gonna stun you, all right? Oh my baloney. Literally. Look. Hey. Look at that. You ever seen some shit like that? No. What do you think of that? Why is it? I gotta hey. get this mosquito out. What's Hold going on. on in there? Why is it holding it? Johnson rod. It's a Johnson rod. It's and a justice liquor, stick. Liquor dispenser. So it's supposed to come out of that and it's supposed to dispense. That is weird. Why would you yeah, want to drink liquor? I know. Like yeah. Hey, let me, let me, let me, you yeah, know, let me pour you up there, buddy. Ooh, it didn't come out, did it? No. You know what I'm going to do? What? <laughs> I'm going to fill this thing full of milk. <laughs> All right. 
But seriously though, tell me that this is not one hell of a damn find. It's got a little button here, you can turn it on. Did you? Well, yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't know if it's, like, can you imagine if it's working. I didn't even look inside. Oh, shit, what if something's inside can of it? Hold it? Dude, no, well, the, that. here's the big question. <laughs> you wanna hold it? Uh, it looks like he's got it under control. Um, Sickness took me. Sickness took me? Oh my God. No, there's nothing in there. Let me look. Look. I can't see. There's nothing in there. Okay, so you stick this in here and then you, tw I guess, do this. Oh my God, I broke it. No, I didn't, okay. That's weird. You know what? Do me a favor, do a little recon on this real quick. Google reverse image, search that and see if you can find out something about it. Okay. Because why would somebody have Switch. that as a liquor bottle? Push. Christine. 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 Oh my God. Now it's pouring responses. Christine. Sickness there took me. Seen. Cemetery forest. What if there's a cemetery that's undiscovered in there? There might be. There was like a little piece of concrete that I said could be like a grave marker. Yeah, that'd be some shit. Can I see your telly? My, my tell? Oh yeah, sure. Okay, guys, the camera just stopped. I apologize. I apologize. Please accept my apology. We are about to get up another intention, hit another location, and at least just trying to figure out what the hell this thing. Are you doing it? Yeah, I mean it's loading. Slowly. If you can move quicker, that would be great. Tell your phone that. Move fucking Tell faster, right? That. Listen, Alicia. Find out what that is. We'll come back online here in a minute, guys. Uh, we're gonna step up the intense right now. Guys, we are heading to the next pinpoint right now. Is that a deer? It's a deer. You see that? Oh, yeah. It was just chilling there, wasn't it? It was right behind that bench. Uh, we're heading to the next pinpoint right now. We're almost there. I'm trying to drive slow through here because they've really let this get grown up and sucks. This is tell if you're free, I know. Hard. Uh, haunted objects it's an intention that we well, get yeah, probably once every few months somebody suggests this here and we've used it a lot once again we've ended up in a cemetery would you look at that it's all overgrown you can't even tell there's a grave right here and it's all yeah that's bush. terrible bro yeah this looks uh I mean a really cool cemetery uh, very, very not good condition, man. Nobody's kept uh, this thing like they should. All right. All right, let me uh, get out. I would stay in if I were you. Just because I don't, you know, I don't know who might come in this place. Okay. Haunted object. Let's take a little looky. I got some old ones here. Some some shroomage. Look at this, how it's grown up like that. That's t dude. How many times are we gonna see this? We just see it everywhere, don't we? I think about the life of these Randonautica videos and these adventures, and this has been like something that I've been seeing now for years. Is just places where people are supposed to be resting in peace, not taken care of sad really fucking sad you know we, we we contribute like we come to these places and we clean up graves and sweep off graves especially alicia man she really goes crazy i can't take a lot of the credit like i do like bring a garbage bag and i'll pick up like garbage but she really goes crazy i've seen this girl bring like I don't know if it's bleach or not i don't want to say that but i've seen her bring things and like clean these stones up and make them look good again If somebody just came here and, and, and mowed and weed whacked, I mean, God, it looked 10 times better. You know, I don't know the people's like position either. So like, I, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not trying to make it sound like maybe the people that own this aren't able to do that, but it's just sad, man. You don't ever want to see like people that you loved 
I mean, just imagine if your family was buried here. Would you would you be a little upset? Walk in this. Somebody's came in here and trimmed it up a little bit. So it looks like maybe a family member of this certain area right here is probably came in and straightened it up a, a good bit. That's probably what it's come down to is just if you have somebody buried here, they check in on them and keep it out nibbly bibbly. Haunted object. I mean, well, it, it, you know, first off, here we go. We got uh, got a whole cemetery here. That, this whole cemetery is a haunted object. I do love cemeteries, though, man. I mean, we we really we really are blessed to be constantly visiting these places that have been forgotten. I'm sure that, hell, you never know. They could be on the adventure with us right now. I'm starting the spirit talker, sorry. Hold on. Hopefully uh, Alicia disconnects it from the truck. All right. I love coming to these places because they're so peaceful, but oh, look at that. Dang. Holy cow. These aren't in just bad condition. They're in terrible, terrible condition. Oh, anomaly. Something big's living under there. I'm trying to hold my comedic tongue while I'm here. Sometimes I can and sometimes I can't, but when I get to these cemeteries, I definitely uh, <laughs> I try and, and hold it because I think we all know I can get a little foul mouth. Nervous. Yeah, nervous. I get a little nervous too. Look at this. Just some random wood sitting here. Get a little foul mouthed and I think there's a ton of spirits here, so some of them might not want to hear that. That's weird how that one's laid on top of that. There's just some if you look really close, there's just some regular bricks. Like Do you believe? I believe, yes. Absolutely. I believe in you spirits. I believe that you're communicating right now. Yes. There's probably a family buried right here by this tree and then their kids right here, the little ones. Dang, man. They need to hire somebody to just take care of this. You know, five days a week. You could probably pay one person to take care of this five days a week uh, cheaper than you could to pay a, a big commercial company to come out here and, and take care of the whole thing you know, in a two-day span to get it up to date.
Jody from Air. All right. I love this fence, guys. How cool is that? Bro, that is so awesome. Oh, look at that one. Vanished. Vanished how? Did I vanish? Did you vanish? Did I vanish from where you are? Everybody in this one right here has a, a big tall one with the really ornate like design. But look, it's just weeds galore, trees growing up, man. This is it's crazy, bro. Just heard something. Almost sound like somebody growled. Somebody, something, I don't know. Oh no. That one's been broke. Somebody broke that thing completely into. Dang. And this too, what the hell? No. You know what I think probably happened right here, guys? Maybe I'm wrong. I mean, I'm looking at the way. I bet a truck probably backed up over these and broke these. Unless a tree fell somewhere right here, maybe. I don't think so, though. Damn. That sucks. Hmm. Haunted object. Haunted object. What's that? Something right there under that tree. It's just a stick. I don't know. It looked like something else. <laughs> I don't want to say what it looked like. All right. Well, despite not being kept up to date, be very beautiful, beautiful place. I mean, peaceful. You hear those birds? It's awesome. What is that? Piece of plastic. I'm looking for an object of some sorts, guys. I'm looking up against like these lines right here. I'm looking under the trees, around these pipes. Anything that could be something possibly haunted. Of course, it may just very well be the cemetery itself. Yo, what is that? What is that? What the fuck? Yo! Oh my god, dude, that is a freaking big doll! What? Oh my god! Oh my god, dude, what? <sighs> Holy shit. <sighs> Whoa, 
That thing weighs like 50 freaking pounds, bro. What the heck? Yo, look at this. Oh my God. That's gotta be the biggest doll I've ever found. Yeah, I'm gonna stop looking right now. I'm gonna take this back. Hold on. That is insane. What's up with those eyes? Why is it doing that? I'm gonna run the spirit box when I get up here. Dude, biggest doll I've ever found. Isn't that crazy? It looks like a real child. How you look at it. Dude, when it, I seen it underneath the thing, I was like, is somebody laying there? There's ticks on it. There is something on it. I don't know. I don't. I don't know if it's ticks or not. It's like shit. Yeah, it looks like shit. It's like shit. Bro. <sighs> her eyes are doing something crazy. I mean, maybe it's just the way it was moving, but. Why she got bugs all over her? I don't know. That's a good question. I'm going to run the spirit talker real quick. Bugs are bad out here. Hold on one second, guys. Just found this doll here is there anything attached to this doll quiet it down spear box has been a little bit slow today hello, hello. Foot's cracked right there. Look at that. This cemetery is an absolute mess. I know. That's what I was Every single one of these, uh, like, you know, plots of one of these. Uh, I had a good life. I had a good life. Wow. Every single one of these fenced in, like, plot areas is just filled with weeds and little bushes and trees and. and, and Nobody's taking care of it. Nobody. They need to hire somebody to, to man the whole thing. Yeah, they do. If that's what they consider work, that's pathetic. Yeah, well, it looks like somebody probably is coming out here doing a few bush trimmings and saying, All right, well, time to turn in for the day. Hey. Arrest. 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 Arrest, like arrest, arrested. I feel like, uh, Hold it, my nose. it does reek out here. This is Nats galore. Did you just leave it? Uh, I don't know. I mean, it was under that pavilion right there. I think if it, I don't know who would bring something like this. Like if they were going to leave it on a baby's grave, why they, what? Can we leave it on a baby's grave? Is that a baby's grave? Yeah. Then yeah, I mean I, I don't leave it on it. That might be weird. Well, yeah. I know. Would that be disrespectful though? Hold on, think about that. I don't know. You're gonna lay a a a, oh, yeah. a child sized well, uh, doll on a baby's I'm grave? With it. I don't know. I'm trying to think like. Yeah. I'm not trying to be disrespectful. Well, I know that. I'm just saying. 
Maybe it's not. Maybe we, if anything, put a no, phenomena. Oh my God! Okay, for a second there, I thought it was gonna say pneumonia. <sighs> yeah, this is definitely yeah, is phenomena. Happen. Yeah, it, uh, yeah, I do. Yeah, they're man, they're thirsty. Um, do you have a name? The fuck was that? I think it's a woodpecker. You know how they peck on the trees? Yeah. That's what it sounds like, don't it? Yeah. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Can you tell us your name? Ma'am? Looks like an Elizabeth. Footsteps follow. Wow. Let's listen and hear, hear if we can hear footsteps or not. I don't hear footsteps, but I heard a voice or something come from over here. Did you hear that? It was weird. Do you think that was from far away? <laughs> I didn't see any neighborhoods around here. It was like no. all woods that way. I feel like anytime I acknowledge something I hear, something happens that follows us. Abandoned. Abandoned. She's the doll abandoned. was abandoned. Huh? She's abandoned. Abandoned footsteps. Why don't you get back in the truck? That's fine. I just don't want to swallow no bugs. Yeah, go ahead. At least she can't stand the smell and she's getting attacked by bugs, so. I don't know if I should put it back there or if I should take it. Because nobody's showing up to do the grass here. I think this might be our second or third time we've ended up at this cemetery in the past. I've never seen anybody here. Makes me wonder, like... Who would bring a big doll here and leave it there under a bench? That doesn't make no sense. Vernon. Vernon. I asked for a name. I got one. Interesting. Um... See, sometimes I wish like I had a direct line to you guys. I'd be like, yo, for lifers, what do you think I should do? See, a lot of times when I find things and I bring them with me, it's because I, I, I'm assuming that they're just going to get ruined more when if I leave them there. In this situation here, it's probably safe for it to be under the pavilion. And maybe somebody would come back for it. However, these bugs are all over me. Um, that doll's like two and a half feet, maybe three feet almost. I don't see what little kid would be hauling that around. Like, it's not something you can la da da, you know, it's, it's, it's huge. It's heavy, bro. It weighs like almost 50 pounds. So, I don't know, man. I'm on the fence about bringing it with me or leaving it here. <sighs> what the hell is that? Something on that right there. Jesus, creepy, 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 creepy. Oh my God. Hold on. Hold on a second, guys. Hold on, let me sit you down. One second, guys. I want to st this, stand this thing up real quick and just look at it. I'm not playing with it.
Okay. Whoa! Holy mackerel. Okay. All right. It just ain't gonna work. You know what? Here. Let's do this. Damn it. Damn it. There we go. All right. I was trying to stand it up so we could just like look at it and see if we could get it to do anything, but wow, that's really creepy. Hold on, look at it from this way. Holy mackerel. Holy mackerel. <laughs> Bro. What the heck? <gasps> it just moved. Dude, it just moved. It just moved a little bit. Did you just move? No, dude, 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 dude. Hey, did you see that? Did you just see that? The fucking thing just moved. Dude, it just shook the fucking truck. You didn't feel that? What the hell? Dad, if it's haunted, I'm bringing it with me. That's what I do. There's something right there. Oh my God. Yo, I'm gonna put this thing in the back of the truck. I'm gonna bring it to Dean's Haunted Mansion. No, you're not. Yes, I am. No, you don't tell me. Yes, I am. I'm doing it. Yes, I am. Hey. Hey. You didn't feel that thing shake the truck? No, I was sitting here thinking of myself. It just shook the truck, Alicia. You didn't feel that? No, I felt something like go like this a little bit, but I thought it was just you pushing your foot against the tire. Like, you know how you usually stretch? Yeah. That's it. But I didn't think you okay. it. Okay. The thing just fucking moved. I thought I just seen somebody in my rear view. Please oh don't. my God. Maybe that thing's don't. really, Please really don't. haunted. Yeah. All right, uh, we're gonna hit the next one, guys. We'll come back online in a minute, but uh, we found we found something. Uh, we might've really, really found something here. It's gonna be interesting to see what if anything happens with this doll. Hold on one second, guys. We're trying to figure this out. It sent us about 15 minutes away from where we were. And then it just goes out when we're almost almost there. So um, I hate this because it makes me feel like, oh, maybe the app just got hacked and somebody's trying to send us somewhere else, which has happened in the past. Could be a scary thing. It's doing something. Hold on. It's frustrating is what it is. Okay. There it goes. Okay, now we got oh. somebody coming. Here, hold on. Straight up, 750 feet, make a right. 750 feet, make a right. Okay. Whoa, Damn. I know. Well, I had to pull off. Um, 750 feet, it says it's approaching. Okay. It says take a right, Shit. Right, right here. here. How can I take a right right there? You can, well, there is a little, no, that's not a trail, that's swamp. Okay. You can't go through that. Let's see, go that. I mean, I can go, th there was that park entrance back there. I don't like going to that park. It sent us there so many freaking times, bro. And things have happened. Bad probably. things have happened there. And this is midway through this video. We just left a cemetery, found a big ass scary freaking doll, and I really don't want to go there. But uh, at least we're not using like the the most disturbing intention. However disturbing is in our intention, look, weird and disturbing. Look, look, I know, right I know. Here. Well, there's no road here. There is something right there on the ground. Hold on. Right Hold here. on. There's a couple different things. Guys, I'm gonna pull off real quick. Oh my God. Hold on. Let me, uh, I'll double check this real quick. Sure there's no car coming. There is a car coming. All right, hold on guys. All right. 
There's a lot of little stuff over here. This is what I seen though. It's a shirt, okay, all right. You know what it looked like? I swear to God, it looked like one of those like uh, bulletproof, not bulletproof vests, but like one of those tactical vests. All right, there's no way. There's no road here. There's nothing covered up whatsoever. I mean, it's not that grown up. It, like I could, but I don't think it's smart. Let me go turn in up here and get about 500 feet in and then see if there's any way to cut over. Maybe there's some paths, but I have had trouble over here before, especially when we were having stalkery issues with you know who. I thought it was like a tech uh, technical, a tactical vest or something. What was it? It's just a black shirt. Oh, black shirt. Yeah. Okay. Uh, hopefully. Okay, it look like fun. Dude, that wasn't even 700 feet that way, but it said turn into the woods. That was weird. It showed a road going straight into like green woods. Maybe there is a secret road over there. Or maybe back. Okay. Would it be okay if I park here, you think, or no? Mm, okay. You mean to turn your round up here? Yes, yeah, so I okay. can see. That way you're on the right, right side, side of the road. the road to be on, yeah. What a weird, weird, weird day today, guys. Okay. I hear you, I'm about to get out. Shut your mouth. It's the only feature I don't like about uh, these vehicles, man. Put your seatbelt on, put your seatbelt on. Tell me one time, why don't you just, you know, program something in there that says, put your fucking seatbelt on and just tell people one time, that's it. One time, not two, 100. Beep, 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 beep. Sound like Aunt Agnes. Okay. Holy chicken nuggets and buttermilk ranch. Oh my God. This is scary. Tom, Dick, and Harry. Virgin Mary. Yo. Yo. I'm on a dirt road. I seen a dirty toad. So what? Catch a nut. Grab a butt. I'm like, yo, what's up? I'm walking down some clay. About to lay where I stay and play with the AK. Hey. Get hate by a snake. Oh! Alicia throwing out the rhymes. All these cats wondering how I snagged a dime. I done pulled up on the bitch and I didn't even drop a line. I was like, yo, girl, it's your time. She's like, what are you talking about? I'm like, bitch, shut up. Don't talk with your mouth. Then I started beating her down. All right. Why do I feel like I'm going somewhere, bro? Why am I even going this way? There's a road through the woods, not up there. Ah! Okay, okay. I'm scared. 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 Woo! Woo, doggy. How many yay how now? Hey, what are you going to do over here? Let's get a little dirty, a little freaky. I don't know where. All right. Hello. I'm sorry. Can I come in your woods? They look pretty fucking gnarly. I done put my girl in some pink and she looking like a Barbie. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Daddy! Daddy sticks! Oh god. Oh god, where am I going? Where am I going? Why do I keep going? <laughs> Uh, uh, I gotta pee so bad right now. Oh my god, I gotta pee. I gotta pee, guys. Oh my god. All right, listen, I can't hold it. I can't hold it. Oh my. If I was you, I'd probably hate me too. Seeing what I do, wishing you could do it too. Bitch, if I was you, I'd probably hate me too. Seeing what I do, wishing you could do it too. Oh my. <sighs> 
Let's see what we got here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I got nervous. I had to go. When you gotta go, you gotta go. Hello? Weird and disturbing. Are you down there? Hello? Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm so scared. Weird and disturbing. It's a higher learning. Bitch, I be turning and burning. Uh, is Spiderweb going this way? I am not going any further. Nuh uh. Thank you. Thank you. Well, that was a nice light while it lasted. You know, uh, sometimes you win, most of the times you don't. That's okay. No, I'm not giving up. I'm not giving up. I'm gonna probably step in my own piss in a second here. Poor Jordans. <sighs> Look at this. Look at these. Look at these beautiful Chicago's. <sighs> Chicago. Chicago. Chicano. Yo, I grew up with the homies in Largo. Marco Polo. Met a bitch named Margo Loco. Think the bitch was from Soho. She said she liked me, especially when I wore my polo. She's like, are you alone? I said, yes, girl, I'm Dolo. She said, oh my God, I heard they call you Mr. Pogo. Stick, dick. Knew a prick named Rick. <laughs> Talked a lot of shit. But in reality, if I ever seen the motherfucker, I pissed a whip him with my blick. Ain't that right, little bitch boy? Wanna be a rich boy. Mad because all you can do is talk a shit boy. Wah, wah, wah. Jody, you're the best is better than all the rest is. Shut the fuck up. You sound like you want me to give you a pearl necklace. Little Rickster. I might hit with the elixir. He'll be like, oh my god, can I please suck your dick, sir? I'm just kidding, guys. I really don't know a guy named Rick. Well, yeah, I do. I know some Ricks. I know some nice Ricks. And I know some Ricks that are, you know, not worth talking about. That's why nobody talks about them. <sighs> fuck. My mother. No, don't fuck my mom. If you fuck my mom, I'm going to be, I'm going to be very pissed. Okay, listen. Listen. Mama D is off limits. Okay? Keep your shit to yourself. Keep your shit to yourself. All right, come on. I know there was something down there. It's just a little too wet for me to step into. It's just a, too, a little too wetty like Betty. I'll pull up with something fucking spaghetti. I don't know. I love spaghetti, bro. Especially with fucking onions, peppers, and meat sauce. What? What? Come on. Come on. Come on. Are we doing what we're doing? Are we, what are we doing? I don't know. Why am I whispering? There's nobody fucking here. See, see, just more recently, it took me over there, that way. Hmm. Oh, the sun's coming out, huh? Getting a little bright. getting a little bright she's feeling a little tight in the shoulders maybe she'd feel better if I hold her <laughs> she said Jody can I be with you my soldier what the fuck is that <sighs> prison shank it looks like it has been keistered somebody has had this in their butt probably not and if they did, why the fuck am I touching it, right? Guys, I think somebody's had this in their ass here. Oh, yeah. That's definitely been up. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This has been up somebody's rectum. Oh, my God. HTD <laughs> for life. I like that echo. You got to add that in Pro Tools. Can't just do it in natural, 
nest like this. Hmm. Let's see. Big open area. It's wide open. Just like Aunt Susie. Oh, the Aunt Susie. What's that? Looks like a bottle full of fucking vomit. Ugh. That's the, you know, I'm getting pissed. I want to find some, I want to find something now. Not tomorrow, now. Hello? Excuse me? Can you tell me where the shit is? <laughs> uh... It almost, almost looks like charcoal. This is just broken up asphalt everywhere. Hmm. You wonder how they got the name for asphalt. Don't you? You ever think about that? Probably not, right? It's not that important. But let's just think about this for a second. What if a long time ago, they didn't know they were making asphalt. And there was like this big old drum. It's like heating this stuff up. And this guy just like... Oh, bumps it with his ass and it turns over and he's like, oh, sorry, that's my ass fault. That's my ass's fault. And then it became the ass's fault. What if that's how that happened? Ass fault. That's what I think. You can tell me I'm crazy later. It's all right. I'll pay the check. I'll pay the check, baby. Yeah. Hey, I, I do want to stop real quick and give a huge amount of prayers to my friends in Texas, especially one of my great dearest friends, Martha and her family, one of my moderators here, you guys know Martha. A lot of power lines went down in their areas, they were faced with tornadoes and things, and, and they're all okay, but you know, everybody's without power and, and they're having to fix their power lines and stuff like that, so definitely just send some prayers. Thank God everybody's all right, man, but these tornadoes this year, even John, John and Darlene. What? You're coming to find me? You couldn't hear my loud ass talking over here? You look like an ant from here. You're very small. Your ass is small. I can't even see your ass from here. All right. All right. Es hola mia. The fuck was that? Oh wait, Jody, you mean that you were so loud that you summoned a freaking coyote here? <gasps> yes. It happens. It happens. What's she doing drop my truck? Oh hell no. Oh hell no, I'm mad. I'm mad! Hey! <laughs> Oh my freaking stars, hold on now. Hold on, something in my shoe. Something in my shoe, don't know what to do. I just wanna eat some fucking stew. What? Oh, cause you wanna suck the poison out. No. She's saying that if I got bit by a snake, she would wanna be close so she could suck the poison out immediately. Yeah, thank you. I have your back too, but your back's like, boo! You look a little bit bigger now. Over there, you look super small. So small, I wouldn't even have hollered at you. I'm just kidding. I like to talk a lot of shit. You know, why not? We're gonna die one day. We sit around saying, oh, I didn't want to say anything because you know, code of ethics. <laughs> code of ethics. Yeah, I feel like being extra. I had to tone it back down when we were at the cemetery. And, you know, I didn't have to. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. I felt like, it, I felt like being respectful in a moment that needed respectfulness. 
And now I'm ready to shine. And I got my coffee in me. Ooh, yeah, Folgers, bitch. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Uh, come on. Come on! Now I'm speaking in tongues. You hear that shit? What's that? Oh, it's just the red cop. That's all. Fuck me sideways. What's that? What's that say? Yo, what? Bro! Get the hell out of here! N organic nipple butter! Yo! What? Is there actually something in here? What's this look like? <laughs> Looks like somebody used it one time. Oh my god, I don't like this nipple butter. I need to find some different nipple butter. Oh my god. Who the hell has nipple butter out here? Like, uh, this looks like a good place to to put my nipple butter on right here. Oh yes, I feel. Oh god, I feel so much better now. <sighs> Alicia, Alicia, look what I found. Oh, well, I don't know if you heard me screaming or not, but I found nipple butter. Nipple. Nipple butter. I, 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 I don't know. Nipple? Nipple butter. All right, listen, I got something. Hold on. Yo, yo. I spit a simple sputter. I take some nipple butter and fuck your crippled mother. I'm nimble like a thimble, but I keep covered with my gimbal. Yo. Soak my dick in gasoline, just the tip. All right, maybe not. All right, listen. Um, <laughs> I don't know what just happened there. Oh my God. All right. Well, it's pretty new. I opened it up. It looks like somebody might have used it one time. Well, I'm not taking it or anything. Oh, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. If you've been looking for an organic, multitasking, new best friend nursing balm that makes pumping way more comfy, Ew. And moisturizes not only nipples, but lips, cheeks, and heels. Well, you found it. Certified organic and non-GMO. Project verified. Project verified. There's no need to wash off before nursing. So it came out of a diaper bag. I guess. Holy shit, I guess. I am definitely setting it right there. I'm not bringing I don't need it. You don't need it. That's weird. I wouldn't even have known something like that exist. I'm going to keep looking a little bit. Is it weird? Is it disturbing? Is Jody a freaking earthling? Yes. <sighs> Want to shoot me? I'm not going to put on my vest. Better than all the rest. Put me to the test. Most of, me, most of these motherfuckers are bitches. That's why they wear a dress. Oh, I feel some M&M coming on. Chicken nuggets? Let me fuck it. Got a bad bitch, but I ain't let her suck it. Chicken fried Kentucky? Bitch, duck it and fuck it. All right, maybe not. Um... There's a nipple butter. Where the hell is everything else? Well, one thing, a woman loses out her bag. <laughs> God, poor woman. Can you imagine that? She's probably like, oh my God, Josephine, I lost my nipple butter. <gasps> no, Margaret. Oh, how could you lose the butter? Well, it's a sadness. What? Oh, yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Oh dear. No fear, so clear. But it wants to come out of those hose ears. All right. 
All right. Let's just take a little looky over here. And then we'll call it. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe we'll call it. We'll call it. What you might call it? Bits of freaking solid. Hmm. don't see nothing at all it hurts in my balls to say we might go home empty today oh, there's tons of witches burrs it's got a little sweet gum tree growing over here what you do is you got to catch these things when they're they're nice and green that's the problem you gotta catch them when they're nice and green and got those medicinal purposes in them. Whatever you do, don't walk barefoot on these things. They hurt like hell. Okay. You know, we found some weird shit in our time. Our time together, you and I. Everybody watching this right now. We have found some weird. Some weird weird. Some scary scary. Some Uncle Larry. Shout out to Uncle Gary. Rest in peace, Matthew Perry. The Rapparets is terrible today. It's fucking terrible. It's terrible. They need to come out for, come out with the medicine for Rapparets. You can thank me later. Hey, sir, are you here to pick up your Rapparets medicine? I'm here to pick up my medicine. So fucking let us in. I know a bitch that lives in Edison. She's gonna be like, oh my God, you need this right now. Right now, sir. What Hi. are you doing? Nothing. I gotta you sure? You, you look guilty as fuck. I am very guilty right now. I have to show you something and it's like so cool. Oh my god, show me. I can't, not in front of the camera. What the fuck? Okay. okay. Alright, <laughs> well, that makes a lot of hey. So, all I did was find some nipple butter. I did find a sketchy long road, but it was wet, it was webby, and uh, I want to come back here in the winter. We got a whole list of places we're coming back to, but <sighs> anything you want to say to the people? Y'all are awesome. They are. They, they are, are awesome. I love them. I wish I could give all of them virtual hugs. I would give you all a high five. I don't do hugs. Kisses, handshakes. <laughs> well, I probably want to just, you know. Hey, Kisses? Hey, hey. Oh. hey, all right. Listen, guys, love you so much. Uh, that's going to be it for this video, I suppose. Uh, smash that thumbs up, comment below, share this on social media. We post every other day, live chat, live premiere, always right here on the Hunting the Dead channel. Love you guys. I'll see you in a few days. But until then, shut up, truck. Until then, sweet nightmares. Woke up in the dawn of the dead. Everything I see is bloody red. Last night I was getting head. Then I passed out taking meds.